can't believe I just weed on my hand in front of you. A bit worse than that for my birthday. Gav. That was a treat. <laughs> How long is that now? Three. Two. One. Never mind, babe. Hmm? Man, it's only our first try. Hmm? No, it's not. What? Stace. Stacy. It's not our first try. I don't understand. I haven't been on the pill since Tenerife. What are you talking about? I stopped taking it. After we spoke about wanting a family. You've been trying to get pregnant and you didn't tell me about it. Why? Because I thought it would speed things up. What? Like if I got pregnant. We have to move out. Get a house. I don't know. You can't make decisions like that without talking to me about it first. What's wrong with you? I don't know, Gav. What is wrong with me? What if I can't have children? And stinking socks. Get home, Mac. Bun. <laughs> oh, you be bastard! You. My bag! My bag! That's in hell! Isa's bag. Isa's bag. <laughs> Get it up! You one legged, pot bellied, lazy bag, can you? <laughs> what are you gonna do? Chase me? <laughs> <laughs> specifically ask you to look after this order. I hear nothing from you, and now it's quarter to five and you phone to tell me this. Well, the carrier couldn't locate it earlier. Couldn't locate it? You said it was there for delivery. Yeah, it was, but I didn't get an update from the carrier until just a wee while ago. I I've spoken with my supervisor and she says that this is very unusual. I'm sorry, but the best we can do is get it there early tomorrow morning. That's likely to be too late. Well, I'll phone the depot first thing, and I'll let you know exactly when it will be delivered. It shouldn't be any later than 10 a.m. I'm going to have to phone our customer right now. But I'm warning you, if this is too late for them, you guys can forget it. And you'll be hearing from me. Believe me. <laughs> 